The average Catholic man really needs to go deeper in his faith. He needs to encounter the Lord, receive healing, receive grace, receive the anointing of the Holy Spirit, and really go deeper. Because Catholic men from the beginning of the church were these fierce warriors that went to battle against the powers and forces of evil. We all struggle, we're all broken wounded, but there's right and there's wrong. There's light and there's darkness. There's truth and there's falsehood. It's hard to live the truth. We fall flat on our face all the time, but don't start denying these things. So basically in today's culture, the man needs to go to battle against this rampant evil, this materialism, this relativism, this lukewarmness, and to actually dig his feet into his faith and do something about it. We are absolutely connected to sacrifice, the one sacrifice of Jesus Christ, but the more that we are willing to sacrifice, the more that we can be a great gift to our wife, to our kids, to our grandkids. The men's conference offers this opportunity to escape the everyday troubles and struggles and stress and even just obligations so that the man is able to kind of have a mini spiritual retreat. Many of us are too busy to go on any actual retreat of multiple days so the men's conference offers a time to escape the cares of the world to engage his faith. Because he's redeeming me as we speak. Because in this very mass he's in the act of redeeming me. And that's what that simple elevation is supposed to send these ripple effects to our mind and soul. Today's culture is really all about this immediate gratification. The truth can be whatever you want it to be. Whatever makes you comfortable, whatever makes you feel good is ultimately what is seen as good. But the men's conference and what it shows about the truths of the faith, what it shows about the Catholic Church is that the Catholic Church has the real truth. Jesus Christ is the truth. And the only true fulfillment that we will ever actually have is found in a relationship with God, particularly through Jesus Christ.